Okay. What's up, guys? Jib right here. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Crossout. Hope you guys are doing well. So for today's video, we're checking out something very interesting. Someone told me about this setup, and I didn't really think about it. And that is the Torero Cavern, which gives us 30% more accuracy for mounted weapons. And then the Omni Wheels got a new perk, which reduces the rate of spread increase by 33% when firing or when turning the weapon. So that should be very interesting. So when firing, we should get less spread. And also the reticle should be smaller since we're using the Torero Cabin. So wait, I'll, I'll do a side by side. That I think that's uh, a better way to test this. So uh So I'm not sure if you guys could see it while editing. I'll check if uh, there's a difference, but it did feel like with this setup, the imp spread was a lot less. So it should be interesting to see how it performs, but we're going to do a two in one combo. So we're going to use the imps with the Omnis and the Toro Cabin just to get to the super accurate shot. And then we're going to switch it out for, of course, the new Catalina Cabin and see what kind of damage uh, we can get with imps and the Catalina Cabin. That should, let me just quickly check it out. Let me just charge up my perk and then uh, come back to you guys do this little damage fear here. All right, we got 10 times the charge. Let's see the damage output. Oh, wow. Wow, okay, that's super quick. And it's not done yet. Wow. If you get 10 times the charge with imps, it's gonna be <laughs> insane. Let me just quickly test it, test it out on this guy. Nice, massive damage. Oh, we're overheated. Oh, that's gonna be wonderful. Let's see how many uh, uh, radiators it has. Two radiators, wow, we overheat super quick. Uh, we do have an engine though. Maybe that's why we're not using an Apollo. But, you know, this could still be a fun build at 12k power score. Now, you guys just sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. All right, guys, welcome to Old Town. Oh, I forgot to paint my cabin, so that means 20% less luck. Uh, we got a lot of targets here, though. We got, oh, bots. Yeah, we need to farm bots, right? I forgot. So let's farm the bots. And once we engage a target with 20 times the speed, or 20 times the perk charge, oh, it's going to be wonderful. We already got one. Not a lot. Not a lot, but there's a ton of bots left. There's three bots left. Come on, three, three times the charge. Ooh, wow, the range is pretty decent. Like, I, ooh, what's this guy running? I think already a thousand, fourteen hundred damage. Five times the charge. Six times the charge. Using an avalanche, so we gotta watch. Oh, he's running. He's the last player left. Poor guy. Poor guy. Man, mouse steering really spoiled me. Seven times the charge. Avalanche is gone. Destruction! Alright guys, welcome to the ship graveyard. We have someone at Charlie. I hope that's a bot. The enemy team only has two bots this time. So, well, yeah, it is a bot. Oh, great, 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 great. Oh, we had a human player though. I'm not gonna lie, guys. Mouse aiming has spoiled me. Oh my god. I've been using mouse aim the past two weeks, and oh man, it really did spoil me. Okay, let's farm Kenneth a little bit. There we go. Where'd that one player go? Did he run away? They still have Matthew. I think Matthew should be over here. And with other teammates. Hmm could be an issue. Oh, there's Matthew. What the hell is he doing behind the teammates? He's not aggro. Yeah, he's not aggro on me now. Oh, no. Who's this guy? Who's on? Oh. Fall back, fall back. Come on, quicker, quicker, quicker. Lost the gun. No. Who's this guy? Uh, let's get his guns. Let's get his guns. I got six times to charge. He's overheated. That's what am I. We should have... Oh, we have more accurate shots, bruh. We have more accurate shots. Our guns are sparking like crazy, though. And this guy is a... Oh, uh, Aspect. No! Yeah, Aspects are more accurate. So, oh, God. We have 10 times the charge. No, no. 
I wonder if our SD will be 10 times stronger too. No! <laughs> Alright guys, welcome to the Desert Valley. We uh, changed out the cabin. We got a Torero cabin. We no longer need to farm bots. But I do want to though. We got Orlando here. Whoa, bro. That's probably a ver this guy again. Bro, what is wrong with you? Are you in love with me or something? Gee, you always come after me. Already lost the gun though. That's unfortunate. I'm sorry, Wolfie. Ah, oh, he lost the gun as well. That's so annoying. Let's get his generator though. Beautiful. All right, cool, cool, cool. Oh, bro, how is he so accurate? Oh, God. Yeah, we're pretty ripped. We got good face. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, we're not ripped. Dude, these builds are so... Dude, those are all hovers. Which are just superior to ground builds at the moment. And I honestly don't know how to deal with them. With this build, at least. This is not my build, so I'm not familiar with it. And it's also just for fun build. It's not fully optimized to, like, protect the guns and stuff. I'll just help out as best as I can. Our team got wrecked, bro. Uh, honestly, I would prefer the Catalina cabin instead of the Torero. The, the, the perk of the Catalina is just better. All right, guys, let's try it again. We are at Old Town, and we got beers from Brad's. We got Wealthy. We don't have a perk to charge up again, so uh, it might be a little bit easy. We just need to focus on stripping. This guy is using machine guns and cannons. We got our team with me. We got four players here. Oh, nice. Switch up aggressive. Beautiful. Switch up a little bit more. Lost a gun already? Who shot me like that on the side? That would be some nice perk chuck farming right there. Yeah, I'm not I'm not feeling this cabin man. It's it's a good perk, but why go for this if you have the Catalina? Oh, he got annihilated. Oh. Oh, yeah, I can't. Even with the accuracy, I can't strip his weapons. Too much protection. Let's try. Oh, shh. Oh. What the hell was that? Yeah, I'm not feeling it. So we're going back to our Catalina in build. We are at. Bro, that was scary. I was, I wasn't even ready, and this bot started shooting me, and I'm not even ready again. Getting shot by this guy, Mr. Tiger. Okay, I still want more perk charge. Well, let's farm Jamie a little bit. Four times the charge. Beautiful. <laughs> Six times to charge. This guy is a perfect farming uh, tool. Oh, <laughs> and they want to nerf rotation speed. Devs, come on. Play your game. 
All right, let's push up a little bit more. I only got two guns left, two under durability, not a lot. Oh, we can sure mess up the enemy. Damn. Okay, maybe not. Seven times the charge. Beautiful. Assist. We almost have our whole team left. Oh, a header and a uh, machine gun build. I got the header, boys. Ten times the perk and one. Oh, no. Oh. Yeah, that Catalina and Arbiters is pretty deadly. Well, guys, there you have it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I would personally go for the Catalina cabin and the Omnis with machine guns to get more, ac well, not more accuracy, but damage and accuracy because the Omnis already give me more or less spread. So I would go for that. But, you know, the Terrero cabin one also works. Maybe not with the imps, but I remember using the jewels once with the Torero cabin, and I had fused jewels for a less spread. I believe it was these. Yeah, less spread. So let's quickly check out the jewels. Do we have another one with less spread? Yeah. So something like this. Yeah, that's a pretty tight spread there. Yeah, maybe I should have used jewels instead of imps. <laughs> yeah, close. And even at range, that's a pretty tight spread. Let's do a side by side quickly. So I guess stacking the perks does help with specific weapons, but for the imps, there's not a ton you can do. But yeah, hope you guys still enjoyed the video. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Really appreciate it. Have a great day. Peace out.